All right, welcome everyone, good afternoon. Welcome to the City of Laredo Ballot Drawing. Dr. Victor Trevino, Mayor for the City of Laredo. Not too long ago, I was there where you are, but the journey has been long. And, uh, it's not too long, but it seems like it's been long. And uh, one of these uh, candidates will be city council members and may be sitting next, next to me up, up there. So this is important. I would like to request everyone to encourage as many people to vote in this upcoming election because this election is probably one of the most consequential elections in our lifetime. I will also ask everybody to become familiar with our election laws and to represent the best in us. Because by signing up, you run for public office. You have chosen to become a public servant where people come first before any individual goal or loyalties. Maintaining voter integrity is very important for a community to prosper. With that being said, I wish you the very best and good luck and please enjoy speaking to the people and connect with them. This is true democracy. So we'll be on standby. Thank you. Mayor, thank you very much for those kind words. Uh, my name is Mario Maldonado, City Secretary, and welcome everybody. Uh, I'm gonna start off by introducing some of our staff members here that are gonna be assisting us. Uh, First of all, I, I want to introduce uh, Honorable Mayor Dr. Victor D. Trevino. <laughs> Mayor's wife, Rosa Maria Marquez de Trevino. De, de Trevino. Our Public Information Officer Director, Noraida Negron. Also with her staff is Andres Garcia. From the City Secretary's Office, uh, Marta Navarro, okay. Angie Arispe, Stephanie Alcala, and Carlos Ramirez. We also have uh, our men in blue and white uh, from the Fire Department and Laredo P uh, Police Department. I'm going to introduce the candidates by district, and the order that I'm gonna introduce them is the, the order in which they turn in their applications. Uh, from District 4, Rick Garza. Ismael Lozano. Osvaldo Valdi Guzman, Jr. Tanya Benavides, Manfredo M. Salinas. We also have a writing candidate, uh, Priscilla Gordiloca Trevino. For District 5, Ruben Gutierrez Jr. Jose Ovando. Jesse A. Perez. <laughs> District 7, Vanessa Perez. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> uh, District 7, Michelle Molina. <laughs> District 7, Ramirez Flipper Felipe. <laughs> District 8, Alisa Cigarroa. <laughs> District 8, Luxandra Guerra. <laughs> Sergio Torantes. 
and Horacio G. Palacios. Okay, I'm going to discuss the, uh, the procedures uh, to draw the candidates' names for the, the ballot order. Uh, first, we're going to start by, by uh, in numerical sequence, the districts, District 4, District 5, District 7, and then District 8. The candidates that are going to be called to come and draw will be by whoever turned in their application first and the applications are, are time-stamped uh, upon uh, receiving. Next, the candidate will draw a number. If the candidate is not present, then I have uh, designated Angie Arispe that she will be drawing for those candidates that are not present. The numbers will be drawn by some white ping balls that uh, have a number assigned to them and they will be placed in this bag and nobody will be able to see the numbers uh, uh, they'll draw from, from, the, uh, from the bag. The other item that I did want to discuss that is somebody decides not to run because somebody, somebody can back up and, and say, uh, you know, I decided not to run. Uh, the, I believe the deadline is Friday. So in the, in the event that that happens, like let's say for the, I'm, I'm just saying district four, uh, let's say whoever is in number, uh, place number four decides not to run, then, then the, the positions just move up. That's the order that we're gonna follow, okay? So let's, uh, good luck and let's start drawing um, for district four. Yes, I'm gonna, okay. 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 So these are the pink balls that are gonna be drawn and they do have uh, the number one, two, three, four, and five assigned. So for, for district uh, four, we're gonna place the, the five ping balls inside the bag. Gotta make sure it's only one, one through five. Yeah. Give it a good shake. Uh, the other thing that I did want to say that the candidate or whoever they want to de designate to draw, they're welcome to come up and draw draw the uh, number. So the first, the for District Four, the first uh, candidate that turned in the application is Rick Garza. Yeah. Number three. Ismael Lozano. Number five. Osvaldo Baldi Guzman Jr. <laughs> Number two. <laughs> Tania Benavides.
Number one. Manfredo? <laughs> I'll let you draw. <laughs> Number four. At the, at the end of the drawing, uh, we will allow uh, the candidates and their families, friends to come take pictures with the uh, results, okay? Okay, for District 5, okay. one, two, one, two, three. Okay. <laughs> Marta. Go ahead. You go ahead. Eh? Okay. Um, Ruben Gutierrez Jr. <laughs> Number three. Jose Obando. Number one. Jesse Perez. Number two. <laughs> Congratulations. District seven. One, two, three. Okay, go ahead and, go ahead and shake them for me. Shake them for me, okay? First candidate, Vanessa Perez. Number two. <laughs> Michelle Molina. Number one. Yeah. Ramirez Flipper yeah. Felipe. Not present. Okay. Number, number three. District 8, we have four candidates. First candidate, Alisa Cigarroa.
Number two. Okay. Luxandra Guerra. Number four. Sergio Dorantes. Okay. Angie. Number three. And Horacio Palacios, not present. Number one. Okay. Any questions? Well, that, that concludes the, the drawing. And, and thank, thank you very much for your attendance, and good luck. <laughs>